Hey folks, welcome back to Todd Bosley's world famous YouTube channel. Check out the things in front of you. You're not going to believe this. I have a customer standing here and she just told me how she got all of these items. It's really amazing. Tell us the story. Well, I go out and I look through people's trash and this is what I find. I had found the rings. I had found in somebody's trash one day and I didn't realize it until I got home. And I went to this bag and I found the gold rings and I found some silver. Yeah, this is a diamond ring here. Wow. So you're just out walking down the street? And... No, I'm out driving my vehicle. Oh, okay, so you do this like this is something you do to try to make extra money. Yes. Yeah, no kidding. So do you find this kind of stuff very often or is this an unusual um, find? No, I usually find at least one or two things, maybe maybe once a week or whatever. And I go out probably like two or three times a week. Yeah, you know, I have a lot of people that do garage sales. They sell to me. And folks, if you're watching, just to give you a good idea, this ring here is worth uh, more than $120. So just, just to give you one idea of just one, what one of the pieces are worth. Here's another. This is a 10 karat ring that she was able to find. Um, this is a bracelet. It's it's broken, but um, it's clearly marked 10K right there on, on that. And of course, this is a diamond ring which is really, really nice with a nice older, you know, gold band on it. A lot of this is sterling silver. Um, these are some older sterling silver bracelets. You can see that they're marked 925. 925 is the marking for sterling, and that means that it's 92.5% silver. And typically the other 7.5% uh, can be, uh, it's mostly copper. Sometimes it can be brass, white nickel. There's a bunch of different things it can be. Here's a bracelet that she found. And so this was all just like in one box or was it throughout the whole load? It was in one bag. One bag. One bag and it was wrapped in a doily. Oh yeah, yeah. So how did you know that you had a treasure? Like when, at what point, or does it when you get home, you're looking through it and you're like, I think this might be real? I looked through, I looked for the 925 or 14 or 10 carat. And once I see that, then I know something's it's worth something. So that's when I call around and I find different places or find, well, I found you to be mm -hmm. able to take it in and, and see what I can get out of it. I'll teach you a few things. So this ring here is marked 14 karat. Um, and of course, in Europe, and there's a lot of European jewelry here, the uh, European marking for 14 karat gold is actually 585. That means it's 58 and a half percent and then when you're looking at 10 carat it may not say 10 carat on it it may say 417 which is 41.7 percent gold remember that gold works on a 24 carat system so if this is 14 carat then it's 14 parts gold and 10 parts are not again we go back to copper brass the different things that they put in sometimes they can even put uh, precious metal in when you start to see stuff that's like 22 karat, 24 karat, that's really soft. You can almost break it. Um, that's very popular in Asia is the, the higher end uh, 22. And it'll, it'll almost look fake because it's so, so bright. And again, uh, this one is marked 10K, uh, but also could be marked 417. So, hey, this is a really nice find. I'm, I'm really glad you brought it in. And uh, don't discount garage sales. Garage sales, you can go out and you can buy all kinds of different things and even, even some different auctions depending on the auctioneer and their expertise. But uh, I can tell you I have, I have found a lot of good stuff at garage sales. Well, congratulations. I know this is, a, this is a good find for you. Folks, I'm Todd Bosley from Ohio Trading Coin and Jewelry. If you're looking to buy or sell, give me a call. My number is 330-323-9775. Thanks for watching. Check out all of my other videos about all the other finds and different things that we buy and sell. Have a great day, folks. Bye-bye.